Welcome to another Photoshop tutorial from tutorvid.com. This is going to be a quick little tutorial to show you how to know if your image is properly isolated or not. For microstock photography especially, there's lots of photographers trying to isolate images on white and getting rejections for not having the image totally isolated. And for example, this image here, it looks like it's on white and it looks like it's fairly well isolated. But to tell if it is truly isolated, one quick way is to go up to the Info tab. If that's not showing, go up to Window and Info. And then when you go over your image white, it has the RGB values of 255, 255, 255. So if you look over here, you can see in this top, it is all around 250, which isn't white. So it has to be edited to make white. And the surefire way to see the entire image really quickly, the one that I like, is go over and create a curves layer. Then drag the darks all the way over. So it's an extremely high contrast image in the lights and now you can see all over here is not white and so if this had been white to start with it would stay white even when we increase the contrast so I'm gonna edit this a little bit and show you what it should look like all right now I've touched up the image a little bit you can check out the tutorial on how to do that if you want to know but now if I use my curves layer again the high contrast one you can see this is the edited image and you can see there's still a shadow around the edges which is often acceptable for an isolated image but if we compare that to the original one all up here has become white and when I play with my contrast layer and bring that contrast way up you can see this top part which is pure white doesn't change at all and then you can see where the shadows are if you want to adjust those a little bit you have the option and so bringing up the contrast is a great way to see where your slight shadows are and if you have your image truly isolated. And that's it. If you want to download an HD version of this tutorial or check out more tutorials, head over to tutorvid.com.